after he met with us, things like started happening to him, like haunted wise as well. See if we're haunted. I know we're haunted, bro. Are you sure? I don't want more proof. <laughs> I love doing haunted stuff as long as no innocent people, you know, are hurt. Yeah, the fact that we're like affecting our friends is what needs to change tonight. Yeah. What if it's not the places that we're going to, but it's us? Because every single place that we go to, something happens. We heard that, dude. Listen. This is the most like I've ever heard. Something's going on. It's trying to light. Maybe it's not something that's attached to you guys, but it's you yourself. We just got off the plane, and literally as we landed, Jake got a nosebleed. Like, look at like, it was bad. Spread those nostrils, brother. Oh yeah, it was you can bad. See it there. I was holding my nose the whole time, and I think the old guy next to me thought I just thought he stank. <laughs> Jeez, like as we freaking land in Kansas for our next series, not a good start, but let's let's go. Yeah, no, he's not gonna come with us. Yeah, it just sucks. It's not gonna be like the same. So what do we do? So this is the actual first video that he's not involved in, right? Is it? Yeah, I mean, he said, I, I didn't think he was gonna quit, but he legit was like, no, I'm not gonna do it. We called him like three times. We even saw him at Elton's video and he was like, yeah, good luck in Kansas, I'm not gonna. But he <laughs> said it like, he was like pissed off in a way. You know what I mean? Like he wanted to go, but he just couldn't. I mean, I, I bet he wanted to go, but he's also like, wow, Sam Colby lied to me. You know, la last time they promised I was going to do this, like we weren't going to do any rituals, we ended up doing rituals. We didn't do a ritual though. It was the fire fire thing that was completely different. Yeah, I think it was, I think it was like, yo, if anything crazy happens, I don't want to do it because they didn't want to do it in the first place, but you guys convinced me to. So all I'm saying is we just have to like, proved him somehow that we're not haunted and then maybe he'll like get our trust back maybe all that negativity and you know like him believing like made it worse because you know like spirits like attach to the people that believe most yeah so like at the end of the day maybe we aren't haunted maybe it was just like our vibe was like too scared so now that we don't have anyone scared we can go for it yeah it was his negative energy that was you know attracting all and if the we can prove that to him and then he can just get rid of all the negative energy, then maybe Cora will come back. What if that's dangerous like for us? Because we don't have anyone telling us to stop when we're doing something stupid. <laughs> that's true. <laughs> but that's what's gonna make this series interesting. Hey guys, it's Sam and Colby. And Jake Weber, because we're at his house right now. <laughs> welcome to <laughs> Welcome to the Kansas Series, we are back here with not quite the full gang this time. It's kind of sad. No, unfortunately, Corey didn't want to join us this time. He said that, uh, he just, he just didn't want to come. Whoa. Did you see that getting like super blurry already? So today we're here to, without, you know, the distractions or anything like that, we're here to come back to the very start of everything, which is Jake's house, <laughs> where we grew up, and we grew up in- We grew up in this house, too. Side. This is Mikasa. <laughs> we're gonna see if we're haunted, guys. Guys, we were here at one point when we did- oh. We did Vine here. But yeah, guys, it's gonna be a little bit different without Corey here. We are only coming to Kansas for one sole purpose, and that's to be able to prove to him that we're not haunted, so we can get the whole group back. But he did say, if this video gets 200,000 likes, then he'll come back. I don't remember what I'm saying. Uh, that. I think he uh, did say that. Did you say that? I thought he said 300. He did say 300. <laughs> <laughs> but in all seriousness, what do we need to do? Because if we're gonna get our whole group back together, this is the best time possible to prove if we're haunted or not. Well, I did some research before we left and there are quite a few paranormal investigator groups around here. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can help. Maybe we should actually like stop putting things in our own hands, get professionals see if they can like tell us anything. So we should go to the places that we think are haunted that we've been before, way back when. Yeah. And then see if uh, see if that's where things started. 
I'm sure, yeah, for a little shout out, a paranormal investigator would do it. Like we said, we're gonna do more research. We're gonna make sure we get with the experts to actually figure out if we're haunted or we're not. We're trying to actually figure some stuff out this time, yeah. unlike Witches Forest. We need some help this time, I feel like. You guys ready? I'm ready. Let's do this. Jake, you ready? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Okay guys, so a couple things. First, we called the paranormal investigator and we got him for tonight. We're gonna meet him at like 8 p.m., 9 p.m., right around sundown at a bridge that you went to way, way before in the past, right? Mm -hmm. What's this bridge called? Theorosa's Bridge. Theorosa is the lady that dropped her baby or threw her baby off the bridge. There was, we'll get into what? the story later. Oh God. <laughs> While we were calling this guy, we were kind of explaining our story and, and kind of saying like how we think it could be us that's haunted instead of like the places we go to. And he said something very interesting. He was like, maybe it's not something that's attached to you guys, but it's you yourself. Which, who knows what the heck that means, uh, but he it said freaked he'd us out. said he later. We probably should've got that on camera. Ugh. But it's just so weird because everything is lining up to what people have said in the past. The psychic from Stanley Hotel series said that something bad was gonna happen to you and to Corey. Mm -hmm. Corey's already gone. The, the witch in Witch's Forest literally said, like, we were dealt the death card. That's supposed to represent a new chapter after we're all anxious, all the chaos from the tower card happened too. Which, we all went crazy in Witch's Forest. Corey quit, now we're here trying to, like, get everything solved again. So is again. this, like, us going to Kansas, the new chapter? Who knows? That's something we need to find out. Oh, we gotta wait till sundown either way to go to this uh, Theorosis Bridge. Oh, and one more thing. The guy that we're talking to right now, Tim, very nice guy, is a demonologist. Study of demons. Study of demons, so. so he's our guy. <laughs> we don't know this guy, he could be super creepy. We're gonna find out. Demonology? What the frick is that? <laughs> so, do you guys wanna pass the time? Yeah, what do you have in mind? You ever heard of corn? Ow. 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 Oh, my balls! Ow. Oh! I didn't think I'd get railed in the balls like that. If we keep running randomly, we're gonna hit our balls on this. Yeah, dude. <laughs> Ow. 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 This is so Ow. Fun. Bad idea, bad idea. <laughs> oh, God. Ow. Ow. Uh. Horrible idea. <laughs> I think this is it, guys. Now here's our guy. There's our guy. Hopefully, hopefully we don't die. I'm scared. Hey, Tim. How you doing, Colby? Timothy. Nice to meet you, man. Hi, Jake. Jake. Nice to meet you. And Sam. Sam. Yeah. How you doing? Fantastic. So, which you? one are y'all from Kansas? All, All of us. us. No way. From yeah. Wichita. I'm from Wichita. Oh, okay. Oakland Park. Kansas City. Oakland. Overland Park up in Oh, Kansas is that really Kansas? What all did you learn about the Erosis Bridge in your quick cramming session? Um, a little bit. Do you, is it cool if I film you? No, that's fine. Okay, that's fine. cool. The main one that we saw was that she was a Native American and she had a mixed baby with a white man and I guess like she threw it out of shame over the bridge, right? So there's a lot of variations of this. Yeah. This is your typical crybaby bridge. There's crybaby bridges all over the place. Yeah. Mm. Each one has its own lore. Yeah. This one actually has a little bit of fact. Back in the early 1800s, the maps go as far back as the early, late 1700s, there was an Indian nation in this area, okay? And there was a settler, one of the first settlers was actually up this road. Oh, wow, okay. And, kind of maps out. <laughs> the, and it's a white settler and they had a ch uh, child, by the, daughter by the name of Theorosa. From there it gets really mucky. Uh, a lot of people did some research on it. You can only get so good on, you know, what the lore is. Obviously there's a child, the child got lost, and now she's out looking for her child. And a lot of activity here, when it was uh, wooden, people would claim that the bridge would glow purple. Or Whoa, or different what? Years, right? Really? Supposedly, yeah. if you park your car and cr call out to her, put it in neutral, your car will move. But the biggest thing that people complain about or see is just apparitions around here, just white shadowy mists. Wow. So, and have you been here before? I came here one time, so I started paranormal investigating uh, back in the 90s when it wasn't cool. Oh, okay. Right, we were all geeks, <laughs> seriously, right? And we came out here and we started getting things, and that's how I actually got hooked on it. Growing up Roman Catholic, a priest got a hold of me and says, hey, why don't you come work for us? So I actually belong to the Ava International Order of Exorcists. I'm a demonologist for them. What does that mean exactly? I specialize in demons. 
So yes. when somebody believes that they have a problem with the demonic entity, they actually send me first before a priest to find out what's really going on. And if perfect, if uh, there's something there, you know, um, typically I'm endowed to be able to take care of it. There's three different types of exorcisms. I can do two of them. The one that TV shows is the major on the person, and that's rare, and only a priest can perform that. The thing that's always our problem is no matter where we go, like it always just seems to like we catch something every time. And every like, single that time. That doesn't happen usually. You're wondering if you're haunted, right? If it's following you. Yeah. That's you know, the main that, thing. Yeah, that's a very real thing that can happen. Okay. okay. People can get haunted, uh, attachments, whatever. Um, you met many people that have had attachments to them. Sure. Sure. I get attachments as well. We were seeing shadow people in the house. Usually there's activity beforehand. Yeah. And just last night, our, you know, we have hanging pots and pans. They started going across the kitchen. You said this was last reason. night that yeah. happened? Yeah. Oh my oh God. My but let me ask you guys, and, and truthfully, yeah. I mean, when you get into large social environments, do you actually kind of feel crowded? Do you, do you feel like you, you feel better withdrawn from people? I, mean, I do. Yeah, we're mm. both definitely like, yeah, I usually want to go home. To himself, <laughs> yeah. How do you feel when you're around the crowds? Still like I'm alone, honestly. Okay, all right. Yeah. Disconnected? Mm -hmm. Well, good trait of somebody who's a medium or has some sort of paranormal activity is to be empathic. You're picking up on people around you. Or you can actually feel pushed away, you know, withdrawn from them. Mm -hmm. Or you can actually pick up on all of their negative energy. You know, there's psychic vampires out there. The true term, people suck. Well, yeah. they could be sucking off of you and you can actually react negatively to it. A lot of times you think something's going to happen and, and it does. Yeah. That happens way too <laughs> Every much. Every single place we go dude. to. Honestly. So you could be stuck uh, being in this uh, medium world. You know? So what, is there any hope for us? Or like, what are we supposed to do? No. Fantastic. So, <laughs> my daughter is a medium. Okay. And uh, she's actually really good. And it kind of sucks in a way because we went on this one case. Mm -hmm. And she was doing a walkthrough. And she comes around this corner and looks up the stairs to the landing. And she says, oh, somebody committed suicide here. It's like, well, what do you mean? She says, I see somebody hanging there from a noose and his body's vibrating. I mean, oh. who would want to see that? Yeah. You know? So it wasn't long after that we started teaching her how to shut it off, drain it out. She actually hasn't come back since that particular incident, yeah. but it wasn't that. I was it say, was, that's pretty traumatic. Yeah, <laughs> it, 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 it can be. What did you think about all that? Like, what, what do you think about this guy? I think he's a nice guy. He seems really cool. What, did you hear what he said? We might not be like attached with something but we could be mediums like if we go we just sense psychic energy like, yeah and or we attract that because like we just have like another sense like have you ever even thought about that i used to think about that when i was younger but i never had believed in that yeah me neither and i mean i've never like seen anything with my own eyes i don't people or anything like that i don't think yeah but it's just something to think about So this is an obvious three. So it has a chip in it with a bunch of words in it. Spirits somehow get this thing to voice the words through this. He comes up to it or any t change. Oh, you can tell when something's around. Is it already picking something up? Yeah, it's getting, <laughs> it, sometimes it gets random words. So the first one was saw, the second one was business. Does it show up right there, the words yeah. itself? Oh, you have to give the spirits permission to come talk to you. When you're done, you have to remove that permission too. If you don't remove that permission, you know. Yeah, we have trouble saying goodbye sometimes. You don't look so sure. You're kind of looking away, inviting spirits to come talk to you. <laughs> yeah. I'll do it. I'll All do right. it. All right. It's for See? science. Yes. Yes. This, this is for science. Up. Oh, it just got cold. Something just passed in front of that, making that thing cold. And it's still That's cold. I literally crossed my arms right when you said that. What? <laughs> I didn't feel the exactly feel the temperature drop. It is breezing out here, but I don't know. I'll set these up on the bridge so that we can see if they get set off and I'll set up those uh, night vision cameras. Cool. Cool. Sounds good. Let's freaking do this, guys. Finally going more expert and professional with this. Marty, I'm scared. It's a little hot down there? Yeah, it's a little warm it's down a little here, warm. buddy. Whoa. So cold hearted and it turns cold. It Maybe it's That's just the, you. It said dude. apple when you walked by. <laughs> apple. Wait, did he say maybe it's just me? It's it's been cold ever since I've grabbed it. Why hasn't it changed yet? It's just always cold. Or it's hot. Look. Here. It's warm or oh! <laughs> oh my god! 
<laughs> so just to catch everybody up, our buddy Tim over here is setting yeah. up oh. a bunch of different frequency Natural readers. A bunch of different frequency readers all across this bridge. And then he's also setting up two different night vision cameras for us to see if anything happens while we're gone. Yeah. So if something does happen, we'll take the footage, put it in there. If nothing does, probably not going to put it Darn in there. Darn luck. Oh my god. That's not good. It sounds like there's like a door right behind us going. Oh my god. Fantastic. Oh my god. It sounds like something in the bush. <laughs> oh man. Something just fell over there. Yeah, nothing fell. It sounded like it fell off the ledge and hit right here. Is that yeah, what you heard? Yeah, but that was, I set that down earlier. Yeah, no, this hasn't moved. And I was looking at uh, these EMF detectors because I know I had one sitting up on its side. And I guess that one's over. He's but going. Whoa, 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 what? what? Dude, there's a door behind us that keeps I opening. I swear to I, God. I just said, I want to hear that door again. One second later. We have to check it out. We have Actually, to check it out. I swear. As soon as that hit, too, it was like crash, and then he goes over there. You ask for a door, and you get it. Wait, let's turn this back on. I really want to try to pick it out. Here. Whoa. What does that say? Dictionary mode. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, I was like, oh it's okay. god. It's okay. What's that say? Highway. Highway? Yeah. It doesn't happen when we turn the camera on. Yeah, I know. It never works when we have a Wait. camera on. We need to call out for it, right? Or ask for permission. Well, how do we do that? You don't have to be so formal about it. It's just, okay. it's just say, I give permission for spirits to contact us, uh, to touch us, to <laughs> speak to us. I mean, how far do you want to go? You got to give these, just give permission. Yeah. Give them permission remember. to do anything. Revoke the permission when you're done. Yeah, absolutely. If there's anything out there, we give you permission to contact us, make yourself known and present in any way. Amateur. Marker? Marker. I heard amateur, but okay. He didn't say it as formally as him, so he's like, amateurs. <laughs> 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 Sorry, it's my first time. So weird. A kid voice? I don't know if it was a kid. I heard. You heard that? I thought it was you. No, I didn't. No. Oh my god, for the love of god. Voice. Oh my god. It cannot focus on you, Colby, whatsoever. <laughs> I've been trying for like the last three minutes. Let's put that back on the mode and see if it goes back to Colby again. Because that was just. I don't... Called you an amateur now. <laughs> Did you hear that? No. A yeah, dog a whimpering. Big... Or was it a baby crying? Oh! Whoa! 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 How did you not hear that? Now it's green. Now it's base set. Put it in your hands. Dude. Dude, it's you. What's it's that you. mean? It is you. What's that mean? It's not focusing, I'm scared. It's not focusing on you, that thing's turning cold. What does that mean? Is I that, can't define it for you. Is that worse than it being red? Wow. Whoa! Oh, what's that? You ever seen that before? No, I haven't. You've never seen that. Sorry. You know? <laughs> Look, Jake is fine! I'm telling you. Does that mean I'm okay? Huge. There's something with Here, take it. Wait. Take it. I don't want to. Wait, I don't what, want to punch what, that anymore. What? Here, give us a hand. I don't know. I, you didn't hear it, so I'm just going to move on. What? <laughs> Leaving us in the dark like that? It is changing. Is that a good thing? Wait, what does it say? What does it say? It says run. Run? No, no way. No. Look at that. I'm not going to not sit on that It head. says run as soon as it gets to me. Well, you better run, brother. Run. <laughs> but it's not focusing. All right, there we go. Business. Oh, that that's means. the second time this came up, though. Business? Yeah, that's the second time it's been stated. So that seems a little more than random if it's been stating it twice. Yeah. Uh, run your business. There you All go. All right. 
Go get the new merch, it just dropped <laughs> today. Link in bio. Blue, blue, but then he's green. Just checking. I mean, <laughs> it's, it's worth like, it. You know, worth. maybe we're demons. God. Here, Jay, you know that again. Thanks. I said that Colby shouldn't come down there because but, he's because he's wearing his new shoes. But that you wanted to go down there. But I want to go. And then we all sat here, and immediately after, it said solo. Don't wait. No, no, Jake, no. Jake. So <laughs> what? It's so who is calling who's you? Who's calling you? Oh, it's my friend. You're getting some relevant stuff here. So I think that you guys should go under the bridge. You should command it. How do we command it? You just say, with all my authority, I command any spirits around here to communicate with us. Kind of like you'd be speaking to a child. Okay. Right? Okay. So all right, let's go. It doesn't necessarily mean that they're going to be responsive. Sometimes it irritates them. You know, in, into thinking, well, who the heck are you? And give you a smack or something. Oh, sweet. This meter says climb. So I think it agrees that we need to get down there I somehow. Down there. Dude, I there? heard the noise again. What? Yeah, me that? too. Wait, wait, you wait, heard that, dude. Listen. Something's going on. Shine the light, shine the light. I can't see anything out there. I don't have a light. What do you mean? You not grow a flashlight? No, uh, it's dead. It. Something's dude, out there. Faster. Wait. Shh, shh, shh. Concentrate. Jake, say that thing about Therosa's baby. Therosa, I have your baby. <gasps> you hear that? Look at this meter. What the heck? As soon as we walked oh, up to it. The oh. door! I'm gonna turn this IR light on. And uh at least. Whoa, 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 what? 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 The camera. Dude, you do it. Oh, I can't hear this worth anything. This is the most like I've ever heard. Like the most I've ever heard on a trip with you guys. That's what I mean. Something's back there. I'm following you, Sam. No, 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 no. You came in the wrong way, bro. See, All I right. don't know where to go. Oh my God, there's gnats everywhere. Oh, Sam, can you lead the way? I'm scared. Dude, come on, you got this. Man. Of snakes, not the Erosa. <laughs> I forgot Kansas has poison ivy. Hey! Guys, oh. there's big scary oh. things. There's big scary things. Oh, God. I swear to God, a gnat just oh. went my Something nose. just bit my arm. God, dude, look at all these gnats around me. Oh, God. They're going in my nose. Is that poison ivy? No, we're fine. I'm a Boy Scout. Trust me. Oh, okay, fling the branch in my face, brother. Yes. Oh, oh. Go in there. I just fell the over. Can somebody say new shoes ruined? It's where Kurt Cobain used to go write his songs. Watch out, it gets squishy, man. Dude, look at this. God! Why would you take new shoes to a paranormal one? Because nobody said we're going to go under the bridge and walk the muddy part. Theorosa, get these bugs off me, please. Theorosa, I command you to show us that you're here. We're not asking, we're demanding. Show us you're here. Oh my god. What? The door. Again? Yes. Dude, I I honestly think that like if we have any time just to get closer to that sound. Virosa! Oh! I heard it! Oh my god, Colby. Yeah. What if it's not a door sound? What if it's a baby squealing? Oh, it does sound high pitched. Virosa, if you're here right now, show us the sign. We're not here to play around. Oh, we got his shoes dirty for you, so we demand. Oh my God! What? What? Go! 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 Oh. Free us from the spirits that are harming us. Free us!